We do obviously have a special guest every week here at Quizlemania, and making his first appearance on the show, it is Brian Zane, everybody. I'm happy to be here for Quizlemania. It's really fun. I'm really excited. Awesome. So on, on your channel, Wrestling With Regret, uh, you cover a huge expanse of wrestling history. Everyone in this quiz is very afraid of you. Uh, is that knowledge, the knowledge that stays in your brain, or is it a research it, then forget it sort of situation? It is a gift and a curse. Yeah, there's things that, you know, uh, there's things that I've like studied for this channel that, you know, a couple years later just leaves my mind. So hopefully I'll be able to go into those deep nooks and crannies in my brain in the mind palace and I'll be able to hopefully find some relevant information. Everyone thinks I'm like really good at wrestling trivia. I don't think I'm that good, but I'm under the pressure. I don't think I've won any of these trivia challenges yet, so we'll see how it goes. Well, if it's any consolation, I mean, actual knowledge means very little in Quizlemania. Uh, as we all know, Wrestlemania 3 was host of one of the greatest uh, most prestigious, most lauded moments in all of wrestling history. So Quizlemania 3 will try and start with something equally lauded. It's whose nips are these. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Oh, man, you're going to get Damn, hello. Of that one, Adam. Mm. Whose nips are these? Wow. Brian, whose nips are these? Uh, I think it's the man with the best set of tits in wrestling, uh, Triple H, and they even drill a sledgehammer with nipples. <laughs> I think you've done a Luke. <laughs> very, very, very good. Uh, can confirm these nips belong. It turns out everyone's racist, but Brian, it's Triple no. H. No. I know that tan incredible. anywhere, Jack. <laughs> you oh, know man. your hunter. You know your hunter boobs. I'm so proud. I, oh, have, a very, I have a very vivid memory growing up. Like, I was in like eighth grade watching wrestling, and Triple H and China are making their entrance. My dad walks in, and this is his comment Triple H and China, women with huge breasts, men with huge breasts. <laughs> always <laughs> resonated with me. So that's why I always have an association. Whose hmm. nips are these? Whose whams? Whose nips are are these I, i've gone for vince but it's probably hogan as everyone else is saying it brian i got a uh, hulk hogan oh, oh, hogan. No. oh randy you mad genius however did you guess they were of course hulk hogan oh. <laughs> yes <laughs> look at them well oh, done oh, everyone sorry. Streaking away, he chose his words carefully, with 15 <laughs> points. Oh. It's Brian Zane. The man knows his nipples. I am the nipple master. Let's do this. Uh, anyway, moving on to our next round. It's the only thing that can be actually <clears throat> considered a trivia round. It is paper you <laughs> All right. So which pay-per-view is this? First match is... New Age Outlaws versus the Acolytes. <sighs> New Age Outlaws. Brian, Brian no. is buzzed in. Is it, is it Rumble 2000? Is it Rumble 2000? What a guy. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> 10 <laughs> points. Oh, oh, wrestling oh, wrestling no Rain point. Man into this. Oh, quiz. man. There's a oh, there, no. there looking cranny. Looking cranny. <laughs> there we go. Boys, me, me, my brothers leave. <laughs> me, and Luke, me and Luke both said this is Brian's round. And if it comes up, <laughs> everyone is screwed. Next pay per view. <laughs> Someone oh. just. You might just. Brian. Want to oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> go on, Brian. Uh, SummerSlam 2002. Well, well now. <laughs> well now. Oh, dear. Oh, oh my oh, God. Oh, dear, oh, dear, boys. Well, I'm just going to hit the old dusty trail, boys. It's been a lot of fun. I'm just going <laughs> to... All right, so the next round is brand new. It's The Weakest Ink. Oh, <laughs> nice. Terrible Wrestler Tats. Whose is this? I, am, I that am, am that I am. And Brian? I was going to guess uh, Hogan because he's been going through some stuff in his older years, <laughs> getting tattoos for no reason. So I'm going to guess the Hogan tattoo. Un un unstoppable. It's Hulk Hogan. No. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. He's cheating. He's looking it up on Wikipedia. Hell, I am. <laughs> <laughs> he is that. He is. <laughs> All right. Come on. Who is this awful fan of tribes? Who's that? Uh, let's start with Brian this time. I'm going to guess uh, Randy Orton before he got the sleeves. I'm just... Uh, oh, that was what I thought. But I'm not sure, though. Well, oh. in a handbag, it's Randy oh. Orton. Look how bad they are. 
fought that before. God almighty, he's white. Uh, and in, in first place with 93 <laughs> points, it's Brian Sane. Go for the, go for the triple. Go for yeah, the, can, you, can you break the triple digits? Three digits. Well done, mate. Uh, um, survival the of the people who know the most about a very specific wrestling category. So this final category of Quizlemania <clears throat> 3 is quite simply SummerSlam main events. Reverse chronological order. <laughs> I'm gone in the first round. Andy. Uh, Brock Goldberg. Come on, Brian. Take it out in style. 2016, was that Brock Orton? It was indeed Brock Orton. 10 points to you, Brian, which takes you over 100. Uh, so the final scores are in. Thank you so much for joining us for Quizlemania 3. Right, hang on a second. I'm just going to remove Ollie and Laurie so that we can have an official handing over ceremony of the Quizlemania Championship. All right. Andy, uh, I, take, I leave it to you as the uh, once and former Quizlemania champion, a man who has lost his hair in the pursuit of quiz. What would you like to say handing over your trophy? The one round that actually needed trivia, you proved that it was important. Um, <laughs> I'm proud to have won the first two weeks. Um, I will now close all my Wikipedia tabs because they were clearly useless. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming on, and I look forward to seeing you beat everyone for weeks to come. Here you go. Oh, well, thank you. Thank oh, you very much. You oh, it's such an honor oh. to have this uh, this award, to be the new champion. Um, I went into this not really expecting that I was going to uh, do as well as I did, uh, but it's it's really cool, really fun to, to flex my, cre my, my trivia muscle uh, among some quality opponents. This has been a lot of fun, and I look forward to defending this championship every three or four months like Brock Lesnar does.